Okay guys, what we're actually looking at is a HF linear amplifier, the BLA350. As you can see there it is. At the minute when you switch on, it's in standby, automatic, and um, you've got 24 degrees Celsius. Uh, don't worry about the B12, uh, 1012. That's just there, there because of uh, how I've got the switch set and it goes up to 600 watts but I don't think you'll get that you probably get about 350 depending on the band that you go on okay what you normally do to get everything started so simple as long as uh, you've get it a try yourself first uh, switch it on there's the switch to go on um, to do the menus all you need to do is press here where it says on so you press that there's it goes ALC setup on the back um, of the amplifier you've got something that looks like this okay that's on my computer screen just so you can see it um, the only thing you need to do make sure you've got the ALC and the standby leads connected uh, ALC at the top standby at the bottom and just to the side here, that's the ALC trimmer. So with the ALC trimmer, all you're actually doing is loading from your radio um, 10 watts, 8 to 10 watts. So make sure you only do 8 to 10. In the manual it says do um, 100 watts or full power from your transceiver. I'd suggest to do 8 to 10. Uh, make sure it's set on that, which mine is. Um, so all you do, um, we just need to put it on FM. So I've got it on FM. I'm just going to key up now. As you can see, it's on the correct, on the forward. Now the reflect, uh, 1.3. That's what I've got, so there's no problem. And my power setting, it's 200 on this one. But there's my power setting, and that says 10 watts. So that's okay. So all I need to do now is once you've set the ALC, so you're going to ALC, so set there, uh, you'll see on the front there the dig, digitals. When I key up, that says 9 watts. So that's what I've actually got 9 watts going from the radio to the amplifier. So what you do there, press OK, so it's come out of that setting, press OK again, you don't need the temp, nothing, nothing else you need to set up really unless you need to, so read the manual. Uh, Vox, SSB delay, fan speed, dimmer, information, that just tells you the uh, software that's inside, what current software it is. Uh, default, that sets everything back to default settings, your factory settings, and escape then press your set just there that comes out of the menu then then you're back to normal standby so just turn it on so now it's in operation it's on automatic you get the fan first because it just blows anything that's actually in the fan out so don't forget you're on 10 watts and now all I need to do is set everything up so if you keep an eye on the meter there uh, let me just pull back out of it. Yeah, keep an eye on the meter. I'll set it all up. So now there, I'm on 20 meters and it says 200 watts. 14.1. And with that 9 watts, I've got 200 out. So that's what I'm doing at the moment. And that's how easy it is. So, as I say, you've got your power there. Might as well put everything into uh, automatic. It's a lot easier. Uh, because then everything can be done uh, by the amplifier itself. You haven't got to do anything else. Only thing you have to do, as I said, set the trimmer for the ALC how you want it. Uh, once you've done that, uh, come on to, uh, from standby onto one, 
and make sure the thing you've got to make sure is you've only got about 9 to 12 watts going in if I go up from 10 watts to about 9 watts which I can do and just turn the amplifier off a bit put it back into standby go back onto here that's 10 watts so if I just go a little bit more just over 10 watts just over 10 watts it might trip just depends it might actually trip it so let me just check no yep there we go too much power going through so what you need to do now because you've got that error is turn the amplifier off turn it back on let it all reset turn your power down again on your radio I've just turned it down so now let's make sure the amplifier is not on but back in standby check your power a little bit too much so that's why I'd say 10 watts there we go that should be 10 watts now so put it back on from standby to on and I'm back to 200 watts output uh, from 10 watts input and that's how easy it is really but don't forget always watch the temperature and um, if you do ever get an error it does actually say either put it into standby or reset it by pressing the on off on the mains and the only thing you really need to know about the back really is your trimmer there for your ALC once you've set that in then you should have no problem at all right hope you enjoy your amplifier the BLA 350 really nice Thanks, bye.